1971 Chevrolet. Impressive, isn't it? Sweeping, sculptured lines, a longer lower silhouette for a more massive appearance. Impressive. Some kind of car, the 71 Chevrolet, and some kind of market. A market chock full of different people. People who lead the good life, insist on the best, elegance, luxury, plushness. People who buy caprice. Then there are others, all Americans. But people like, well, like most Americans, people who buy Impala. And still others who look below the surface, discovering a wealth of value others don't even know is there. Those people, they simply buy the best car for the best price. Starting with Caprice and Impala, right through Bel Air and Biscayne, 71 Chevrolets are the best cars at the best price. You'll see for yourself later. But first, we want to show you the 71s from the ground up, so you know everything, so you're ready for anything, ready to respond with the 71 Chevrolet. Begin at the ground. New wider 15 by 6 inch wheels are standard with a larger attaching circle and bigger attaching bolts than last year to hold rugged fiberglass belted tires in place over any surface. The beginnings of a great ride, a great car. Next, both front and rear tread widths are stretched almost an inch to make big Chevys even more stable. Last year's Impala answered to the Big Rider. This year, Chevrolet wheelbases have grown an extra two and one half inches to a luxury class 121 and a half inches. Call all 71 big Chevrolets the Smooth Riders. And we've smoothed the 71 some more with a new longer separate perimeter frame that isolates passengers from rough roads. Bring on the roughest road. Chevrolet's front suspension design uses new full A-type control arms and forward-mounted steering linkage. The new setup means greater ride smoothness, quicker steering response. A redesigned four-link rear suspension complements the smooth ride, keeps the rear wheels grabbing the road. End result is a built-in levelizing effect. Add a new constant velocity universal joint for a smooth, vibration-free power flow, and all the smoothness components are in place. 71 Chevrolet, the smooth rider. Power to go. Power to stop. Fade-resisting power front disc brakes are standard for all full-size Chevrolets in 71. They are coupled with new finned rear brake drums. Chevrolet's most luxurious car ever, the 1971 Caprice. Caprice, in coupe or sedan versions, impressive. Individualized styling with its own high-style grille and crest. Raised engine-oriented hood surface flanked by smart end lamps that combine parking, turn signal, and front side marker lights into one unit. First impression, final impression, this is a luxury car that belies its price. Luxury proportions, a longer hood, shorter deck, wider expanse of glass, lower belt line. Distinctive side trim continues the Caprice fine car theme. Smart body moldings accentuate the sharply sculptured body. 
rear fender skirts, and circular ribbed wheel covers are, of course, standard. At the rear, groupings of six lamps are set in a rich brushed aluminum panel that spans the entire width of Caprice. Pleasant journey. Another day, another way to go Chevrolet. Impala, an All-American for All-America. Five ways to fly through life. Custom coupe, sport coupe, sport sedan, four-door sedan, convertible. Choose you and Impala. Picture that. Picture Impala's 71 face as captivating. Its bold new grille is a mark of styling personality shared by Bel Air and Biscayne. In the rear, dual groupings of rectangular tail lamps are inset in the body above the new deep section bumper that emphasizes Impala's width. Preserved in the new 71 design is the Custom Coupe's elegant formal roof line shared only with the Caprice Coupe. Distinctiveness exclusive to Chevrolet. A rainbow of new colors grace the 71 design and proportioning concept. 15 high fashion exterior colors, 12 new for 71. The subtle blending of 71 styling to accept all the dramatic new vehicle proportions also results in the longest, lowest full-size Chevrolets in history. All 71 models are an inch lower this year, yet actually have more interior headroom. Overall length is 216.8 inches, less than an inch over last year. Ingenious body proportioning that provides the benefit of a longer wheelbase without increasing parking problems the best of two worlds. Another plus of the new Chevrolet design concept is improved interior roominess and comfort. Two-door models have plenty of shoulder room for you and four friends, and rear passengers will certainly appreciate the added comfort provided by two and a half inches more legroom. If your tastes run more toward four-door models, they too have plenty to offer. Front and rear shoulder room is increased two inches. Back seat passengers are given almost two inches more leg room. Interior roominess, interior luxury. <laughs> Pretty soft is an understatement. Caprice and Impala seats have deep, rich foam padding to assure your riding comfort. Luxury to satisfy your individual instincts for those who know what is right. Caprice, five luxurious interiors in custom knit cloth fabrics. Other full-size Chevrolet interiors are available in fabric or Easy Care vinyl in six trim colors. New instrument panel design is typically Chevrolet. Traditional large glove box, thick padding throughout. Cluster area, column, and steering wheel are black for all 71 interiors. The rear view mirror is cemented to the windshield for substantially reduced vibration and annoying mirror shape. Glass surrounds you. Four-door and sport coupe models have a distinctive wraparound rear window that adds a measure of styling lavishness. The destination ahead greets you through a panoramic picture window, a larger sloped windshield that invites in the free open outdoors, a dramatic 14% more total glass area in some models, all that glass, plus a new thinner energy absorbing windshield pillar combined to assure greater visibility and an accompanying increase in safety. The new Chevrolets include longer 18-inch wiper blades to clean more area more effectively. 
1971 Chevrolets offer increased quietness and comfort, thanks to several major innovations in body design for all series. Example, double panel roof construction, two roofs, a rigid, rugged structure welded together at the side rails and front and rear headers for increased strength. The steel inner panel has computer-located perforations for greatly improved sound absorption. Or flush side glass, curved for a clean, expansive appearance, set close to the exterior body surface where it extends into the roof for a smooth, flush look. Along with the flush side glass, a rounded body silhouette with a contoured effect. Door handles are mounted flush too, so nothing's there to interrupt the flowing side surface. Beautiful. And practical. Inside, seat cushions extend much closer to the edge of the sill, so entry and exit are appreciatively easier. Comforts increased, again, with a new interior ventilation system. In the new system, outside air is drawn into the car through the cowl, entering the passenger compartment under the instrument panel. A special cycle on the heater continually moves draft-free air through the lower vent whenever the ignition switch is on, even when the car is standing still. The air exits through the deck lid louvers. Some cars do seem to have everything including a new standard inside hood lock release. Pull it and get ready for the Caprice Clincher, a 255 horsepower TurboFire 400 V8 engine. Standard equipment in every 71 Caprice. Altogether, there are six big Chevrolet engines, ranging from an economical 250 CID6 to a 454 V8. 10 power team possibilities on some models. Complete details are covered in the 71 specifications and features book. For 1971, every Chevrolet has a new standard evaporative emission control system. More efficient fuel burning and controlled evaporation of raw emissions is now an accomplished fact. Finally, a standard sealed side terminal battery. Special terminals are recessed in the side of the battery. Minimized corrosion buildup. Easier starting on cold winter mornings. That's the 1971 Chevrolet. The most beautiful, most impressive full-size Chevrolet ever. What'll it be? Caprice? Impala? <laughs> Both. Some guys do have everything. In 1971, the guys with everything buy and sell Chevrolets. Respond. Look into the 